Topping today's health cast, a prescription nasal spray that reverses opioid overdoses can now be sold over the counter. Following yesterday's approval by the FDA, Narcan is expected to be in the supermarkets, convenience stores, gas stations, and more by late summer. The approval has long been sought by public health officials and addiction experts who hope to reduce overdose deaths. A recent study reflects a growing concern in health care. According to the Health Resources and Services Administration, 63% of counties in Florida are experiencing a shortage of primary care doctors. Whether it's due to workforce shortage, physician burnout, or just an increased demand for care, right, from, uh, from us as patients, as consumers, um, there is that disproportion between the demand and supply. And then what that essentially translates to is missed um, preventive care, missed on-time screenings, missed um, de detection of disease early, and so on and so forth. And so uh, it's a scary situation. The study also found that the shortage of primary care doctors is leading to increased visits to the ER, putting stress on an already taxed emergency system in many areas. And a new study finds that certain headaches are more likely to occur at certain times of the day and year. A meta-analysis found that more than 70% of people reported having cluster headaches during the spring or fall. Respondents said the attacks usually occurred between late nights and early mornings. The study also found that of the most painful migraines were reported between April and October. Doctors say the findings can lead to better treatment with those who have headache disorders by prescribing medications that target that circadian cycle.